Like, you know, you see all that white stuff? It's cold and stuff. She didn't quite know it at the time. <laughs> but that ended up being one expensive piece of bread. It's a selfish act. It's uh, an unethical. It's unlawful. And it's dangerous. Colorado Parks and Wildlife saw several videos of an evergreen woman feeding deer. <laughs> when you feed wildlife, they become habituated. They expect you to be fed and they associate humans with food. <laughs> Investigating, then issuing citations. $550.50. Lori Dixon says she learned her lesson. I do not advocate at all people to interact with our wildlife, especially not in the manner in which I do. Saying a deer came up to her back porch years ago injured, she patched him up. I was a vet tech for seven years, and I worked with wildlife before. Do we try to keep his rack strong through the winter? If something comes to me and needs my help, I'm going to help it. That's just who I am human or not. But the video outlines a serious issue in Colorado, people not letting wildlife stay wild. They may think it's harmless, they may think it's helpful, they may think that wildlife can't get by during a, a winter, um, but doing that really causes more harm than good. Hey genius, hey my baby, come here. Hoping the hefty fine and this message will change people's behavior.